Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, you know, it's been a while since I've actually made a video. You know, a lot of things has changed, uh, like my hair color, and with the pandemic going on, I think it's just fair that I should probably make a video, you know, about something. So today I'll be talking about gamification and should retailers get on board with gamification? So in simple terms, gamification is adding game mechanics to a non-gaming way. And in this case, retailers might use it for, you know, to drive sales or to engage with customers or, you know, marketing perhaps. We've seen several brands hopping in on the trend. Now we take a closer look how brands could utilize gamification to enhance the user experience while shopping. Most previous use of gamification applied to consumer context is loyalty or rewards program. This is where consumer can attain points where they can redeem for products. Starbucks and Sephora are the successful ones that has been doing this. And you know also how in their applications where we see this chart or progress bar that, you know, when we purchase a certain product, the points get higher and higher, then maybe we can achieve, you know, like a higher membership status. You know, this is also makes the consumers, you know, just want to get to the progress bar. And, you know, this could also generate sales and drive consumers to keep purchasing products and to create a loyal following. As consumers get, you know, smarter, they demand more and brands are choked into this idea of being an interactive storyteller. And one great example of this is my favorite fashion blog, which is called Men Repeller, created by Landry Medin. They launched a website called Repeller, which is their e-commerce site. Their website was so full of vibrant colors, you know, a lot of aesthetically pleasing design. But besides all that features, all that graphically features, what they did is they are really being interactive and they are keeping the consumers engaged with the products. You know, this motivates users to spend more time looking and interactive with the products and this could generate sales also. There are a lot of ways gamifications can provide benefit for a company. But gamified shopping experience will also allow retailers to monitor their audience to gain insights of their consumers and that we can use it, you know, for future on. So yeah, that's a little bit about gamification and retail shopping. Now over to you. Let me know if you have any ideas how gamification could apply to your business. How do you think, you know, gamification, what ways gamification could enhance the user and the consumer experience? Let me know in the comments down below. If you like this video, make sure to like it and also subscribe to my channel. And I'll see you guys in the next video.